Hi, welcome to Castle Toys and Games What's New. This week we have some new things to show you and we're going to get started right off the bat with baby things. So this is not new, but this is very popular. It's a chew cube. has uh, lots of things to grip and squeeze and mirrors and rattles. So what is new is from the same company they came up with a stack and chew. So this is for babies three months and up and it has the same flexible blocks. They're smaller, the babies will be able to learn how to build, and if they throw them, they're not gonna hurt anyone. Sometimes babies with blocks are dangerous. So, moving on, um, this is not new either, but this is paint by sticker, and these, these have done so well that the company came out with paint by sticker for kids. And these have bigger stickers and it's paint, it's like paint by number, but sticker by number. And then another company came out with my first paint cup. Well, they call this color by sticker, but it's the same thing, but this is great for toddlers. It says on the book, on the back of the book, five plus. However, my grandson just recently turned four, well, maybe a month or so now. And today he was in the store with his siblings uh, helping me in the store and he was able to do this. He didn't actually use the numbers. He just was able to figure out where the pieces went. So this, so he's four, so I totally think four-year-olds or maybe three-year-olds would help. And he had a lot of fun. So there's the dinosaurs, unicorns and wild animals. So those are new and it's exciting to have something like that for the younger set. Also in the book world is a new book for probably five or six and up. I think the um, book says itself says six plus, but five-year-old readers could uh, read these. These are like chapter books called Little Sherlock. He is Sherlock Holmes' son and um, and there are puzzles throughout the book. Let me see. Different puzzles in each one. I forget how many puzzles in each book, but um, it's very fun. It's a fun way to encourage reading, to have the reading plus puzzles and character, like cartoons in the book as well. Let's see, where do we want to go next? Uh, Battling Tots is back in stock after years of being gone and another company picked it up i used to play battling top so this is a retro game and and what you do is everyone spins a top and you try and the tops are bump, bumping each other out of the rink a lot of fun so the arena is in the box you get yeah. four players four spinning tops i love this game this, is, this, this you'll want to play this over and over and over and over and over you want to get a game that the kids will play over and over this is it and that's rated six plus. No educational value whatsoever, but really fun. And this is Kale Bots. We have this at Christmas time. So now we're into the Christmas rush of things and we get this back in. This is called Kale Bots. It's good for, um, I believe, six plus. And it's actually good for adults too. So uh, you get two robots. It's kind of like Rock'em Sock'em robots on steroids so parents are going to love playing this with their kids trying to bump it is it's like you got up. Wii. it's almost like we um joystick kind of things we controllers controlling the robots that are bashing each other it looks great so you may be familiar with air hockey where there's a disc that flies over the the table and so we have been selling the light up air soccer disc for years and so it it has a um uh, airflow which makes this lift and hover so this is the newest part of it and this is O2 hockey and the hockey um, puck right here does the same thing as this air ho hockey um, it, it lifts on the table and so this is a tabletop air hockey without the big bulky table so you can do it on your own table yeah nice we also got in my, my, one of my favorite things is bubbles. I love bubbles. And this is a kit for making frozen bubbles. I do not yet know how this works, but since I'm a bubble lover and I do like blowing bubbles in the winter when they freeze, I thought we'd give this a try. And when it's cold enough, 
I'm going to try. So what do you know about it so far? You actually make them like in the freezer or you're using frozen like with super cold? We know anything about it? Not yet? No. That's okay. That'll this be fun. This is so new. I don't know anything about it. I can't wait it, to see it. Except that it's like frozen you. bubbles. Like you. I can't wait to see it. And then we got in a new line of uh, Lego type blocks. And not only are they blocks, but they're science kits. So these three are kind of stocking stuffer sizes. And these are um, blocks that you put together and then make things happen. I've always loved buzz challenges where you take the, the thing and you go, the handle and, or wand, and you go around the wire trying not to hit it or it's going to buzz. Um, so there's those three that are going to be really cool. And, of course, kids are into... This thing. Burping and farting. Yeah. Mm, sure are. And then um, build your own sound activated dancing lights and a bubble making machine because, you know, I hmm. love bubbles. That's cool. I like that too. These are all five plus, this, these sets. Nice. Yeah. And then um, there's one last set that is a sound touch controlled light show. I'm going to spin this around, Jeff, so you can see that it shows you all the things, all the blocks that come with this. Mm -hmm. So oh, a lot of these come, and you can build more than one thing with it. Um, I was looking at the Flying Saucer, and it has four projects just in this little container. So I'm excited about these. I'm, I'm hoping to see what your responses are on these. And... Um, you can come into the store Monday through Friday, 10 to 6, and Saturday, 10 to 4. We'll be glad to help you out. And you can also buy online at castletoysandgames.com. And you know, it's about time to start Christmas shopping. Yeah, we have our Christmas. Can you get that, John? We have our Christmas wrap up. And oh, yeah. We've been Christmas wrapping and birthday wrapping all day today. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the stores.